What's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. I'm super excited to have you because we're like four weeks out from my competition and I'm on the elliptical right now. I'll show you here. Elliptical. And oh, I'll be 100% honest with you. I don't do cardio at all. But my gym apparently does not believe in heat. And if you're anything like me, lifting when you're cold is pretty much the worst thing in the entire world. It's like you feel like your bones are shattering. Frankly, I can't even function when it's cold out. Like, my fingers don't want to move, my toes and my ankles don't want to move. It's like I turn into this little popsicle and I can't do anything. So I have to try to warm myself up somehow. And the only way I can is by cardio. supposed to get anywhere between like 8 and 12 inches of snow and so we're not going anywhere today so we're just gonna stay home hang out I'm just making my first meal which is breakfast it's it's like 9 o'clock so it's a little bit earlier than what I usually I usually don't eat breakfast until like 11 I sit and drink my coffee for a while but anyways I'll go over what I have so I have three eggs I do a cup of egg whites and then I just get the one dollar bread from Walmart. I do not really track anything. I just have numbers in my head that I generally go off of. Um, numbers that I'm kind of looking to meet. So I try to get between 25 and 30 grams of protein per meal. Um, and then I keep my fats super low. Like I don't generally add fats to my diet. Um, and then as far as carbs go, I try to just aim between like 45 and 60 grams of carbs. Um, and that's pretty much what I do right now. Obviously, if I'm like prepping, like bodybuilding wise, I track. Um, but otherwise, I don't need to track. I don't have any purpose to track. I just, I don't know if you'd call it intuitive eating, but I just have rough estimates of numbers that I would like to hit in my mind, and that's kind of what I aim for. So it's not anything super special. Again, like I said, if I'm gonna do bodybuilding, Obviously, I'm going to track, and I'm going to track very, very specifically, but I'm not bodybuilding right now. I'm not prepping. Um, I am getting ready for a competition, but it's for Strongman, and so I just have to make sure that I stay in my weight class, and as you guys can tell, I am below my weight class right now, so I definitely have some room to gain my weight back because if you don't remember, I lost 13 pounds like two weeks ago when I was sick, and I haven't gained it back yet, so that's what we're working on. <laughs> what we got here nothing fancy like I said just 
trying to eat for how I feel. I am trying to gain weight, so this is a little bit more than what I would normally eat. Um, it is over 30 grams of protein, but not by much. Just while I'm trying to gain my weight back, I'm just adding a little bit to each meal. We are on meal two. What I have in here is three-fourths cup of egg whites, and I'm doing that because I am not going to have enough protein in what I have pre-made. So let me go ahead and add that. So I made this yesterday. It is a chicken chili, but I added rice because I didn't have any beans. And so I just did a cup because I just know that a cup of like white or brown rice is going to be fairly close to my carbs or what I need for this meal. I know a lot of people are probably going to think it's probably pretty gross, but you know, is what it is. I agreed to show you guys what I'm eating today. I love Cheez-Its. The husband and I started watching a movie and Cheez-Its happened. Life happens, so we just move on. I hope you guys are having a fantastic day so far. And yes, I'm still in my jammies. Why? Because it's a snow day. So, snow days happen, life happens, Cheez-Its happen. Now we move on. We are on meal, technically meal three, if you don't count my cheese at fiasco earlier. This is just um, like a shrimp scampi uh, recipe. Shrimp noodles, little Parmesan cheese on the top, and then it has like garlic and just some lemon juice. So super simple. Um, this actually is two servings. It runs about 60 grams of carbs, give or take a, a few here and there, but it is right about 30 or 32 grams of protein. So. About perfect. All right, guys, this will probably be my last meal tonight. I have just some Cheerios. I can have, um, let's see, about two and a half servings. There's 22 grams in a serving. So if I'm going between like the 45 and 60 gram range, I can have roughly two and a half servings. And then this is what normally gets people and it freaks them out. So don't freak out. I use egg whites instead of milk. One, I don't like milk. Two, I don't like milk. And three, milk makes me bloated and feel gross. So that pretty much covers that. And before you say anything, it is not slimy. It does not go down slimy. It's legit exactly like water. So as long as they're pasteurized, you can drink egg whites. And so that means if you crack an egg, you cannot drink those egg whites because they are not pasteurized. Egg whites like in a jug or what you can get at the store, like in the carton, those are pasteurized. So yes, they are drinkable. I'm going to do eight ounces of my egg whites, which is about 25 grams of protein, two and a half servings of my Cheerios. All right guys, that is it. I am signing off. I am going to head to bed as soon as I eat my meal and I will catch you guys next time.